Continuing from lesson 11, learn to control your speed with the throttle. In a corner where the angle becomes tighter in the latter half, the car is more susceptible to driving off the track at its exit. Once you are in the corner, ease off of the throttle before you come up on the exit. Once the car is directly facing the exit, apply more throttle to exit the corner. The key is to ease off your throttle before the corner becomes tighter. Here again, remember to decelerate if you don't think you'll make the turn. Practice completing your deceleration before entering a corner. If you go too fast into a corner, the car will not make the turn and run off of the track. To avoid this, you must reduce your speed before entering the corner. The key is to reduce enough speed so that you can go into the corner with your foot off the brakes. Continuing from lesson 13, practice completing your braking in the straight section before a turn. Here, the marker boards on the side of the track will serve as your guide to start braking. Always remember the distance at which you started braking in your last run. Race circuits often have many features such as curbstones, guardrails, signs and so on that you can use as markers for your driving. Actively utilize these features to your advantage.
Practice decelerating rapidly from high speed as you approach a corner. The basics are still the same. Use the marker boards as your guide to gauge your braking and complete your deceleration in the straight section before entering the corner. An important point to remember here is to apply brakes firmly on your first application and to never let off and reapply brakes again because you applied the brakes too soft or too early at the start. If you end up reapplying the brakes after letting off, your stopping distance will become longer, leading to losses in lap time. Always remember to apply brakes firmly all at once.